fragile but not breakable by hand. Okay. It was a freaking chair. Oh, that didn't work. That worked. Cool. I'm gonna check the other room, then we'll go there. Oh God. East wing. Stand by the light. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Um. Okay. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble, and there's a risk everything will cave in on us, especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Um, okay. She's sitting on the fridge. Of course she's sitting on the fridge. She wants out through the window. No, baby. Do you want out? All right. I guess now we go this way. Oh, God damn it! You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Daniel. Move the box. Why am I roaming? Because this spot sucks. Yeah. Oh, Alstadt and Brenningburg Castle, 1801. Another region rich with lore is Alstadt, deep within the East Prussian woods. Uh, for centuries, there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor, Castle Brenningburg. The quiet forest clad mountains, dressed with scattered lakes, is as picturesque as can be, albeit the area is haunted by the dark. Ask any local and you'll hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twists on the tales, but there are some motives that keep reappearing. The Gatherers. This story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said the soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the cold, dark woods and were forever damned to the roam of the grounds. Their bodies wrought by their tainted souls have left them disfigured and empty of essence. Many have sighted them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move slightly through the woods, shying away from any beholder. They are called gatherers as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living, living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap sacks dragged behind them which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? How many of these are okay? A visit undone. Hey. Okay. <laughs> Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa, the well-known uh, erudite, visited Alstad at the start of the 16th century. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight as he looked for remnants of kingdoms past. During his stay, all the prominent members of society paid notice, and he's mentioned in many records of the time. One day, he went to investigate a burrow in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in the Grand Noble some ten years later. He dismissed the notion of ever visiting Alstadt, which makes you wonder what really happened. Who is this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods and what happened to him? I don't know. And the immortal Baron. The Baron of Brennenburg lives a reclusive life with his family as his, at his castle nearby Alstadt, and like most of those no, of noble birth, rumors are inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveal, reveals little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander a nobleman from the Rhinelands claiming the role as protector of the Prussian state. Alexander helped the region to flourish and remain popular throughout his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage, therefore the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This has fed the idea that the Baron is in fact the one and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago. Lived through the time of occupation and joined the coveted order of the Black Eagle along with the great leaders of this country. Okay, cool. Won't open, it's locked. Damn. Is 
Is there switches in here? Because there's something about switches. Okay, so this side, I have to have it open. I did that wrong. Oh, hey, there's a book. <sighs> Where? What? The bookshelf on the right. Okay. On the right. This right? Yes. Ah. So now we have to find the other one so we can be quick about it. It's in that. Yeah, there's one right there and there's a third one. Where? On the bookshelf behind that. Those. Okay. So let's find them all. Oh. Cool. Thank you, hon. You're welcome. Um. Maybe you have to do it in order? Oh. Oh. I don't like that. Ah, damn. Looks like I found a key. Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their absent-minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brennenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first. It can rot for all I care. Maybe we'll feed them some wine. It would be, in a sense, solve both of my problems. Is the wine poisonous? this? Can't shut yourself in. That's how you're supposed to hide. Something opened the door. They have spawned, hun. Mm -hmm. They have spawned. What have spawned? Did you not see it? Okay, we're leaving. I did not see it, no. Did you hear it? I heard it. <sighs> oh, fuck me. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Smokey. Oh, God, what the fuck? Oh. Okay, so apparently that hurts. Okay, maybe it doesn't hurt as much as I thought it did. Okay, still can't go that way. I, the wine cellar was over here, right? Right? No. The other side? Mm -hmm. You're supposed to help me remember this shit, hun? I don't remember this shit. Sanity now. A slight headache. Dark domed ceiling. Mm. I don't wanna. Fun. Mm. I don't wanna. Do, do, do. I don't wanna go any further. You can't make me.
tools. There is green stuff on the floor. Okay, what? Why can't I grab one of those and use it as a weapon, huh? Oh god, I'm running out of oil. Need to be quick. Oh, fuck yeah. Fully refilled. Okay. Dope. Hey, yeah. Sanity fixed. Sanity bad again. Sanity very bad again. I don't want to. Can't make me. Okay. Guess we're not going that way either. If an enemy is near. I didn't see an enemy, so. I need to make a quick escape. Okay. Aha. Okay, I think there's like, what, one more room I gotta go into now? Which was the angry door room? Yeah. Need the fuck. I have a chair and I'm not afraid to use it. I watch in the I watched enough WWE growing up. Read this first. Wilhelm's last words. My name is Wilhelm House of Gierich. Gierich. I don't know. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I summoned the Castle Brandenburg as most of the aristocracy. <laughs> I was curious about what this supposed knight of the order would want from me and accepted the invitation. Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sorted and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the honors I'd been awarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and do so without que asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. 
I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I brought men, women, and children to Brennenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted in joining us in a toast. The wine tasted fine, and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment for our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolical ways. My men are screaming. Their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their god-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer blank. Infinidaga, how goes it? Pretty good. How about you? Hi, Enraged Wings. Hi, Pippington. How are you guys doing? The game is spooky. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Looks like we got everything. Can we leave now? Oh, shit. Um, that's not what I want to do. Okay, so... I have to like put this on the ground and then pour a bunch of stuff into it? Uh, I think there was a chemistry thing there that you needed to pour each one into and then mix them. Back in the laboratory? Yeah. Okay, then we'll go back to the laboratory because I think that was everything. Notes. And I sense calmine, orpium, cuprite, aquaregia. So that's four, right? Yeah. Okay, so I have all four pieces that I need to make acid. So it's now time we leave. Fuck this place. I don't like this place. I don't... I don't. I don't like it. But yeah, how's your night in Rage Wing? Oh... Things are angry with me. Oh, things are growing. Ow. And they hurt. I... How bad do they hurt? Quite a bit. Okay, so don't touch the pus eggs. Got it. How's the game? Uh, well, farther, farther than I've ever been before. It's spooky. It's not scary yet, but it is spooky. Calm your shit, dude. Aha. Does it matter in what order we do it in? Um, did you hear that? I'm going to this in my mind. Okay, so... That there? No object to be used on. Okay, um, shit. How about this? Oh. It automatically just puts it in the right spot for you. That's nice. Okay, things are getting angry. Things are getting very angry. Oh. Uh... Okay, you hear that, right? Yeah. Okay, cool, we got the acid. Sorry. Oh. Well, how in the fuck are we supposed to get back? Um... Okay, cool. We can't go in there. I was going to get scared. What's this? Well! Oh! 
I mean... No, there's no way we're getting back up that way. So I now need to figure out how the hell to get back upstairs. No idea how. Okay, what, you got any suggestions on? The only thing I can think of is stacking boxes, but I don't think the physics in this game is that good. Out of my way. What is this? One day I will return if it wasn't for the thought of you, my love, I wouldn't be able to go on. When I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as they want to think of you and long for a life together, I know I'm better than the others. I weep for them, they just... They lust for power without restraint, where I only crave fair judgment and safe return. Um... What the fuck was that? Okay, game. Oh. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, well, sure. Is that you breathing, or is that the bunnies? No, that's the bunnies that's bothering me. Sorry, when I get spooked, I, uh... My sense of hearing spikes. Can I jump on these? I mean... We can try this. Yeah? I don't think this is what you're supposed to do, but... The only thing I can think of. Maybe try getting up higher? This is so stupid. Something tells me there's an easier way to do this. Something tells me you're right, but... It's a game with physics. I'm gonna try to break the physics. I just need one more. Shut up, you stupid hissing roaches. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do it, but... That's how you did it. I can stack stuff. I'm gonna stack stuff. Oh. Ow. Okay. Do I run past him? How do you heal? Because I... Pretty sure I've taken enough accidental damage. Alright. Might need to go put a towel in the bathroom. So we can't keep putting his paw under there. Yeah. Okay. Woo! I got a tree in it! Yay! Got a trophy. Progress! I haven't actually seen an enemy yet. I know they're there though. I know they're there. <laughs> I know it. God damn it. It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Um. Can I get my vision back now? Maybe you should stop moving when those visions happen. Maybe. Yeah. 
Fuck. Time has come. <laughs> Time has come and so have I. I laugh, laugh, just because you came to die. Fuck you. Probably should have left that one over there, but whatever. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm assuming you've played this before, uh, Wings? Okay. It can't open the door. I think we're good. What the fuck is that? Oh, cool. Increase my health. Second of June, eighteen thirty-nine. I'm assuming there's an enemy there that just opened the door. <coughs> Inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. Oh, okay. An excessive decision in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the <laughs> Hi, strike it. Strike it. I don't know how to say it. Next Hello. Lay the broken stone ore wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete all? <laughs>